Hey you're right guys, Trish Much is Joe here and today we are watching and reacting to episode 22 of Friends Season 8. We have this and then the two part finale to come and then we're done with the 8th season. But last episode we had Monica and Joey doing a cooking class which was kind of good. We had Chandler and well, Phoebe more so training up Chandler for a job interview which he dropped the ball on in the last 5 seconds. Don't know how he managed that but it is Chandler so... That's probably the reason. And then Ross and Rachel were actually pretty good. So, yeah, I'm curious. I'm assuming they're going to start setting up for Rachel going to be giving birth by the finale because we have a big moment at the end of every season. And they've, I think they said a couple of weeks, an episode, will go, an episode or so ago. So I'm assuming that's going to be coming up. But episode 22, guys, if you enjoy, remember to leave a like. If you're new, remember to subscribe. And if you do want the early and uncut reactions to friends, then come and join us over on Patreon. We will be about, what, eight episodes into season nine by the time this one's on YouTube. So getting to that halfway point of the ninth season. But uh, yeah, all other stuff will be linked down below if you want to join on any of those. But for now... Let's do this. Oh, it's a poster for that World War One movie that I'm in. Check it out. Yeah. World... Oh, with Gary Oldman? Yeah, yeah. It's already generating Oscar buzz. I started that. Oscar buzz. I did. Wow. And the premiere is next week and you're all invited. I bet this is going to be the most the most pauper premiere ever. Today's my due date. Mm -hmm. Is it? Oh. Well, maybe you know, this will I be the I just want to take a moment and thank you guys for how great you've been during this time. This could be the end then. No, they're not doing the finale. That's right. Still no baby. <laughs> okay. On, people, please make some room. Never mind. Uh, sweetie, maybe you'd be more comfortable Never mind. here. Like you haven't done enough. <laughs> you have done a fair amount, Ross, to be fair. I can do. I, mean, I, I wish I were a seahorse. Explain. Explain, Ross. Here we go. Because with seahorses, the, it's the male. Mm. They, they carry the babies. Uh, yeah. I know, I've been there. I remember toward the end. Oh, oh maybe that's a great story. Could you tell it to me while you're getting me some iced tea? <laughs> <laughs> oh, fair enough. Oh, God, get out! Get out, get out, get out! Let's <laughs> Oh, Rachel's been abandoned in some Hey, could we like that scene off Alien? Maybe that's how the season will end. A xenomorph comes out of the stomach. Who knows? Get ready for the baby. Well, you know what? Screw them. <laughs> they don't want me there. I'll just hang out with you guys. <laughs> Everyone's really excited about that. And tear work. Hello? Joey, it's Estelle. It's Great <laughs> news. I was able to get you and one guest tickets to your premiere. One, one guest? You told me I could have six tickets. Well, I sold four of them on eBay. She's useless. I don't know why he's still with her. Oh my god. So that's it? I only get to bring one guest? Yeah. What time you want to pick me up? <laughs> no. Hello? Yeah, no one's picking you up, bro. I only get one extra ticket to my premiere. So somehow I have to pick between you three and Ross. <laughs> I mean, you said you didn't want to go. You said you didn't want to go. I don't. You but did I would say still that. like to be acknowledged. What, just because I'm pregnant, I'm invisible? You're definitely not invisible. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's got to be Chandler, hasn't it? Let's be honest. He's here, so I think he's out. You know, you snooze, you lose. He's not snoozing, he's teaching a class. Well, then somebody's snoozing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good point. <laughs> Chandler by that one. If you were to pick me, I was planning on wearing a sequin dress cut down to here. Ah. I haven't seen this dress. Star in a movie. Okay, you just listen to your heart. What does it tell you? Chandler, Phoebe. done. Phoebe. <laughs> it's Chandler, bro. Well, uh... Chandler's been there since day dot. I think I want to take Chandler. Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, my boy. You know, Chandler's always supported my career. Yes! For acting classes and headshots and stuff. And Well, this would be my way of paying you back. So you're never actually going to pay me back. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> Hey, not every day you can roll up to a premiere. Why not? Joey, I don't think you're comprehending just how slutty this dress is. <laughs> it's a tough one, Joey, but... You always believed in me, man. Even even when I didn't believe in you. I love myself. this. I love this. I always knew yes. you were going to make it. I'm so proud the of The hype Chandler deserves. <laughs> Thanks. That, that means a lot to me. 
<laughs> That's so cute. I'm glad yeah, they've uh, uh, doubled down on the Chandler and Joey bromance this season. We were sorely lacking in it in season, I'd say, six and seven. I bet you that she'll have it by this time tomorrow. You're on. Okay, tomorrow? $100,000. There you go, big or go home. Who's going to help me get up? <laughs> no one's here. Nice. Yeah, yeah. She'll fall for that one. Oh, damn it. Maybe next time. Well, I'll start using that one. The film's called Over Bear. I mean, I'm really sure. Would you mind crouching down a little bit so that I look taller? There you go. No, nice. <laughs> he looks so happy. <laughs> hey, he's not giving her any interviews. I know how uncomfortable you are. You know what? You look great. Oh. Yeah, like 50 bucks. Very good. Very good. <laughs> Damn it. Your 50 bucks. That's interesting that Double you lost. Double or nothing. Now, I forget, do you like to lose? I right, stop it. Oh, don't go there. Double or nothing, but she has it by tomorrow. Fine, you're on. Your head will be lost, Until then, Phoebe. General Grant, why don't you set up camp? Right there. Rach, we gotta go. In a Just... minute! <laughs> People ask me why we're not together. I just don't know what to tell them. <laughs> hey, she's pregnant, bro. No, I'm fine. Really? You don't think that's a little inappropriate? Why is what? it inappropriate? Good God, man, don't anger it. <laughs> yeah, bad move. <laughs> Read the room and the person. Uh, don't call me mommy. It's bad enough you call your own mother that. That's pretty bad. I'm actually with her on this one. Yeah, that's bad. That's bad. <laughs> Grow up. <laughs> I thought I knew who the enemy was, but it was you all along. Big <laughs> <laughs> fight scene coming up. Go ahead. Chandler's no, I knew he was going to be asleep. Pregnant with Ben. Mm -hmm. Were you this irritating? Mm. <laughs> a worthy question, <laughs> but it's Ross, so but I'm going to go with the yes. You've been a little short with me lately. I'm not trying to I irritate wonder... you. Well, uh, you just must have a natural talent for it. <laughs> you know what? Uh, the doctor will be in soon. Why don't we not speak until then? This is a healthy way to start being parents, I guess. <laughs> Seriously, breathe louder, Ross. That's great. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Hello. Long. How are you? Oh, you're nice to her. She has the drugs. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do a quick... And if they have the drugs, then, uh, yeah, fair enough. Taking a long walk. Good, done. And there's the one that's proved most effective. Sex. <laughs> what? Is that real? <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I've never known someone look so disappointed to be told they should have sex with Rachel. I was surprised to see a kangaroo <laughs> in a World War One epic. <laughs> you fell asleep. <laughs> there was no kangaroo. They didn't take any of my suggestions. You suggested that one, of course you did. Were you in the kangaroo shooting out of his pouch? That's my prediction. So sorry. Look, this guy fell asleep. He fell asleep too. Be mad at him. Look, he's dead. Or call an ambulance. Yeah. <laughs> she did give us some ideas on how to induce labor. Yeah, we tried them all. We went for a walk. Uh, we tried special tea. Did you try the big one though, Ross? The main one. One thing that we didn't try, but someone thinks that that will open up a can of worms. <laughs> well, what is it? What is it? It's going to help bring the baby here. Like today, I mean, I think you should do it. <laughs> like in the next hour. I mean, women have needs. Do it, get yours. <laughs> oh, I, I, don't, uh, I don't know about that. If Ross isn't willing to do it, he's not the only guy in the world you can have sex with. Ooh. You can borrow Chandler. Chandler is good. Borrow Chandler. She said good as well. That's not even that much hype. I keep betting Phoebe that you're going to have the baby and... I don't want to lose again. What? You let that one slip very easily, Monica. Oh, you've been making money? You're betting on your friend staying in this misery? <laughs> I'll take that bet. Oh, honey, don't worry. I really do feel like tomorrow it's going to happen. Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 
Oh, Monica, you've gotten scummed. I wanted to pay you back by taking you to the premiere, but you missed it. Okay, so how much do I owe you? What? Give me a number. I don't want to owe you anything. It's going to be so much. It's going to be so much. We're doing this. Okay, now you got me my first set of headshots, right? How much were those? I don't know. Uh, $500. Okay, $500. What else? 500 Well, then there was the second set, the infamous booger headshots. <laughs> okay, so that's another 500 That's 500 500 That's <laughs> oh God! <laughs> uh, then there was that dialect coach who helped you with the play where you needed mm. a southern accent, which after twenty hours of lessons still came out Jamaican. Wow! <laughs> I want to hear this accent. What the hell are you talking about? The South will rise again, man. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's something. <laughs> yes, money well spent. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what else? Rent. Okay, uh, two, three years of rent, utilities. Two, three food. years. Okay, okay. So I'm writing you a check for... Oh... So you fell asleep during my movie. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> uh... clear this thing. <laughs> Drop that so quick. I think maybe the mug shots he could have paid for as soon as it came to rent for two, three years. I was done. I mean, we've done it before. We'll do it again. It'll be a nice way to... I mean, could you just maybe <sighs> attend to this thy needs by thyself, I would just so say. Just labor. Make love? What are you, could a girl? That way? <laughs> hey, someone said it. Someone said it. Always a great way to get into a man's pants. I don't make love. I fuck hard. <laughs> if you know. Unfortunately, you know. Whoops. Oh, I seem to have dropped my fork. Let me just bend over and get it. <laughs> wow, that's a sight. Come on, what's big love to me? <laughs> you know what? What? He's gonna do it, he's just to prove a point or something. Oh, wow, what now, Ross? You're not gonna talk? How on earth will you ever annoy me? <laughs> She's going in this up on Ross. <laughs> Jalapeno would have cleared up your sinuses, but no, <laughs> that's not enough. But if, oh, what are you doing? I'm getting my baby out of you. <laughs> <laughs> He's had enough. His limit has been reached. <laughs> I think my water just broke. Oh, there you go. I am good. Busy, busy. <laughs> Somehow, I actually do believe Ross is that good. I don't know how. Explain to me how he gets laid this many times. He has to be that good. We're having a baby. Should probably go though, yeah. It's a cute little moment, but uh. Oh. You think we have time? Not so much. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe after her water's broke. Maybe not then. Maybe before. Two hundred. Thank you. That's it. I'm done. I don't care when the baby comes. No more betting. Okay. He's gonna. Oh. Hello? Lie. Lie. Uh-huh. I guess we get that one more time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's Rachel having the baby. How did you know that? <laughs> She's so excited. I bet you the baby is over seven pounds. I bet you it has hair. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you it's a girl. We know it's a girl. I'll give you really good odds. <laughs> uh, that would be pretty good odds if <laughs> they lied about it or something. That was a great episode. Rachel's having the baby. I called it the finale. I mean, it's not that hard to call, <laughs> to be honest. But will it be in part one or part two? I bet part two. Part one's going to be like the build up, you know, Shep more probably shouting at Ross, ripping his arm off or something like that. And then part two, the birth. <laughs> the birth. We shall see. But um, yeah, this is a really good episode. I think everyone was really good. We have Phoebe and Monica, probably the weakest part of the episode, but that was still really good. Her making the bets on when the baby was going to be born. I actually really like Chandler and Joey. I love the bit where he's like adding up all the odds, all the odds, the um, how much he actually owed him. <laughs> he went back on that so quickly. I can't even blame him. That would be how much money would he probably owe? Like, I don't know how much they live in New York, so that's going to be expensive as it is. And then two to three years of rent and utilities. On top of everything else that they added on, like, bro, he's he would have been bankrupt. So, 
yeah, probably shouldn't be too mad about that one. Um, but I like that scene before that as well, where he's kind of hyping Chandler up for always sticking by him, and that when he asked, and for Joey to turn down Monica's proposal as well, he's a strong man, so I, I kind of respect that. Uh, so yeah, Joey and Chandler, very good. And then obviously Rachel. Rachel's just amazed, been amazing this entire season. Just how kind of going in on Ross the entire time. Can't complain with that one. So, and they had a little key moment at the end as well, which I like. Very, very good episode. Um, what did we get the last one? I'm feeling this has a seventy eight percent. Do we agree with that? I think this is the best ep since ep seventeen. Honestly, I really enjoyed it. So I'm going to go an 8 out of 10 for this one, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know if you thought of the episode down below in the comments. Like I said, if you want the early and uncut reactions, then Patreon will be linked down below. And I'll see you next time for episode 23 slash 24, even though they'll, they might be uploaded on separate days. We'll see. But I might react to them back to back. Depends how I'm feeling, like I say. Until then, take care. Peace.